hello YouTube channel family and greetings from Sicily. In today's travel vlog, we are traveling from a city called Riposta, or Giara, you know, like a town, and we're going uh, south to Catania, which is a pretty well-known major city in southeastern Sicily. coming to Catania is well if you saw my last video boop, here you saw that unfortunately I have a cracked rib and I've been running on it for the last three days and guess why it's not the most enjoyable thing in the world so I thought I would take today off and I would just come over to the next town because the town I'm staying in it's it's very cheap but there's not really much to do there and I'll just kind of go exploring and uh, maybe look for some gelato so maybe We'll get a little gelato counter down here, boop, boop, and uh, we'll see kind of what happens. Also, side note, last night I watched The Irishman, super duper sad and depressing, but uh, remember the main, the main boss, bad guy, crime guy, he was from Catania, Sicily, and that's where I am right now. So we will not be upsetting anybody, and I will say that it's very beautiful here and everyone's very nice here. Why am I in Sicily? Oh, look. It's like a gigantic litter box. This cat is in heaven right now. I will not disturb you. Why am I in Sicily? Well, it's Jan January 30th, 2020. I live in Paris, so it's Northern Europe. And it's freezing, and I happen to have this week off from work. So there's no work, and then I also happen to find a super duper cheap flight. Wait, I phrase that. I'm gonna have a week off from work. I want to go somewhere warm. So I looked, and I saw like where the warmest places in Europe, and there was the Canary Islands, there was uh, Valencia in Spain, and there was also well, there was there was Italy, which I've never I've never been to Italy before in my life. So I'm like, why don't I go to Italy? See what it's like. Go running, get tan, run naked, etc., etc. I talked about it yesterday, and so yeah, there's also a super cheap flight here and everything. So there you go. So I haven't. I honestly, I feel terrible. The last few days, like I've been in Italy for this is my fourth day now, and all I've been doing is waking up and running and like going back home. <laughs> ah, and it's been awesome. It's been so nice. I went out to eat one night. I got pizza the first night. And the rest I've just been cooking myself and stuff and I don't know man, like I just I just want to relax and not worry about anything. So today we're gonna come in and check out the city. Maybe I'll come back tomorrow. Saturday I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a super duper long run up a volcano. Even though my, my rib is cracked, it's so painful, I still have to do it. Like I came here for the volcano. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. Give me a minute. really have any have any plans um, I'm just gonna walk around and film stuff explore eat some stuff yeah it hurts to hold the camera like this though with my stupid rib it's so frustrating <laughs> Uh, I did not find a fish market here, but what I did find, Slotteria. That was absolutely delicious. Don't know what the other flavor was, but it was awesome. I'm just gonna keep walking this way and uh, we're just gonna see what we come across. This architecture is super old, super, super Italian. It's got kind of like that, that paris -y vibe to it, you know, like the, the architecture, but it's just a little, um, a little less well-maintained. And there's like graffiti and 
but it still has like the still has like the tall windows and the little balcony and you know super quiet everywhere it's i know it's a thursday at like 4 30 but oh yeah i think okay so i noticed this kind of similar how in spain they have the they have the siesta i don't know what the italian for it is maybe it's to take a little napanista i don't know it's not the sorry it's not the, um but the stores are closed from like one to four one to three so maybe uh everyone's kind of just now kind of coming back into the swing of the day that'd be really nice to have a little break time in the middle of uh, of the day of the work day don't you think be, be nice this is the back of the beautiful opera building and there's just I don't get why this is so so rampant everywhere you know when I, when I was running when I was running uh, in the little town I'm staying in Riposta and Ghiare there's trash everywhere on the streets and just like side of the road and just you know, I was looking at some, like, uh, I want to go up to this volcano in a few days, and I was looking at the different campsites or ways to kind of get up there, and um, just saw a bunch of posts. People are like, it's beautiful, but just destroyed by trash. The track I was at yesterday, it's totally abandoned, decrepit, graffiti, broken stuff everywhere. It's a shame, you know? So much beautiful history here. Steve, seriously, everywhere. Just grip for me, this walls are lined with tags <laughs> crazy I think I found myself in some sort of beautiful main area so I'm gonna go this way Ooh. a little, little stop Think there's a there's a sale so like this one or this one they're both super duper soft both half off too trying some, some pants and jacket uh, thrilling day in Sicily right now very Italian. Gelato and shopping. Yeah. Ciao. Have a nice day. Don't go too crazy. <laughs> um, that escalated quickly. I didn't buy too much stuff. I just bought the sweater, but I was in there for like an hour looking at things and it's dark outside. God, all that shopping was like so exhausting and just so much energy and thought, oh thank God. I'm gonna take the edge off a little bit. Just a short, short stop. I know, you might be thinking, Jake, you came all the way to Sicily, Italy, and you're just, you're taking us, the only thing you're showing us is uh, some gelato shops and that you went shopping in a cloth clothing store. What do you want to say, man? It's my vacation. Ow. Honestly, I didn't really come here for like the whole tourist, the whole tourist thing. I, okay, so if you're in the States, you're probably thinking like, oh my God, you're in Sicily, you're in Italy, what are you doing? You should be doing this, 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 and that, and the other. So like living in Europe, these places are like much, much easier to travel to. I mean, it's a very small expense where you could get a round trip ticket to, like I could have gone to Valencia, for 66 euros round trip from Paris. That's, you know, 30 some odd bucks to go both ways for a flight. Like, so if you're, and if you're from Europe, that's normal. If you're from the States, that's unheard of. Most tickets 
anywhere in the States flying are at least $200 and over, at least, right? So I came here, like I'll probably for sure come back to Italy, I'll come with friends or something and I'll do the whole whole touristy spiel and I'll actually kind of like probably do it properly, right? But I don't know, man, I just, I just wanted to come relax a little bit and disconnect and um, I just wanted to run, you know, and it is kind of a bummer that I can't, like I want to run, like I feel good, like I'm in good shape, but I just, I, my rib, I really can't run too fast and so, yeah. Um, so today is just very chill, very relaxed, very laissez-faire, and um, for whatever reason, I'm just in the mood for gelato. And it's super cheap here. Each of those little cones are like between one and two euros. The doubles are like 230, 250. The singles are like one to 150. All right, so I'm gonna keep on moseying down this street where you're just looking at and see if I see anything interesting. Here's what I'll do. I'm gonna try and edit this and upload this muy pronto. And uh, if somebody sees this and you know Sicily really well, tell me what I should do. Tell me what I should check out. I'm leaving Sunday. Saturday for sure I'm going to go to the volcano. I'm gonna run up it. Long run, big run, long run. Yeah, I'll film it. But if there's anything I should do <clears throat> besides that, I could do something Sunday before I leave. All right, so I'm gonna keep on moseying and we'll see what comes up. If nothing comes up, I'm so sorry. Um, not exactly the traveliest travel travel vloggy vlog, but it's fun for me because I just want to kind of go explore a little bit. So, look, more sales, 70% off. I'm trying to find a cool puffy coat. Just had an epiphany as I was looking through all these jackets and coats and Oh, there's this neck warmer thing must they keep getting. Sorry, I had an epiphany that this is the, I remember of a realization, this is the worst travel vlog ever. <laughs> Can I convert this into a shopping vlog? Ooh. A slosh, a shopily vlog. Shopily vlog. I don't need anything. Man, do you guys ever just go into a store and you don't have a list of things you need and so you just get like, you just get lost? Going to Ikea. If you ever go to Ikea, my mom always says, if you ever go to Ikea without a list, you're like setting yourself up for disaster. Super washed out in this picture. All right, what I need, here's, here's what I need. I need gray slacks that I could use, like something like this, but in gray that's not bad, that could like go that I could use to replace jeans that's rugged, like as rugged as jeans, but a little maybe like a different kind of material to use in the winter and stuff. And then I also want to get skiing, not snowboarding, pants. Never going snowboarding again because of my snafu here with my breathing protection containment unit, also known as my ribs. But I am going to go skiing again this winter. And I need pants. So everything's on sale, if everything is on sale, which it is, there's like sales all over the city, and actually like all over Europe. I'm gonna go find some skiing, some skiing pants. I hope it's exciting for you all as it is for me. Best shopping, shoppily vlog featuring gelato uh, you've ever seen in your entire life. Welcome to the running YouTube channel. <laughs> Interesting, Obi Wan. Horizon group. Insert Star Wars Force joke here. All right, guys. I just decided I'm gonna I'm gonna call this video for today for tonight. I am just I I am just I'm a bad I'm a bad travel vlogger. I think I didn't even I didn't tell you guys what the flavors of the ice cream was. The last one I got was like chocolate cinnamon, and the other one was pistachio chocolate. I didn't even tell you what color sweater I bought I bought I bought the, the the dark blue one it's very pretty it's it's so it's weird for me making like these kind of like daily vlog videos again I'm not really used to it and I remember why I kind of stopped doing it before because there was no clear goal or target with it and it kind of freaked me out a little bit because it's just like you could just keep recording forever and there's no uh, there's no point for the video so I kind of prefer making very specific running videos or something about a specific running topic, you know, and then I can make sure that there's like a, 
a clear kind of path towards it and then there's like a call to action and then you guys actually walk away with something instead of me just kind of fumbling around here <laughs> like like i want to have gelato and i'll walk this way next and anyways so next time maybe, maybe if i'm doing like a travel vlog without running i'll kind of have something really specific like today we will go find uh a really nice sweater in sicily or something or something to that effect so um i'm gonna end it here barring anything amazing happening in the next 10 minutes from i'm gonna catch the train back home if i see mo farah and he's running by my god i'll chase after him even with my broken rib and we'll go figure it out but um thank you guys for watching if this is your first hi Ciao. 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 <laughs> if this is your first time watching one of my videos, I'm so happy you made it this far in the video because as you can see there's something really specific going on in this one. Um, usually the videos are about running and stuff, so watch one of the running videos. Regardless of that, you know, if you want to subscribe that'd be lovely, or if you want to hit the like button that'd be lovely too, or better yet leave a comment, right? Tell me what you think of, if you've been to Sicily, what your favorite thing to do in Sicily was besides Mount Etna because I'm going to do that on Saturday like I said. All right so everybody have a lovely January end of January beginning of February and thank you for following along and I'm going to enjoy the next the last few days of my little holiday and I'll see everybody on the next video. All right see you guys. Bye.